I just finished a new painting of the USS Constitution versus HMS Java, and I'd like to show it to you. This battle took place during the War of 1812, and with this surprising American victory, the small upstart American Navy dealt a big black eye to the British Navy, which was the world superpower at the time. The painting is based on my research into primary source documents. The letters of Commodore Bainbridge, the American captain, were especially helpful, as was this chart of the battle drawn by one of the officers on board. Also, Theodore Roosevelt wrote a well-respected history of the war. So how did the battle unfold? Well, cruising in the Atlantic off the coast of Brazil, the Constitution spotted a ship on the horizon. I'll let the letters and journals of Commodore Bainbridge tell the tale. At 15 minutes past 12, discovered a strange sail on the weather bow. Finding the ship to be an English frigate, attacked ship and stood for the enemy. Bainbridge's journal gives a detailed account of the action. From this, I learned which sails were being used and exactly which flags were being flown. He gives a blow-by-blow -blow account of the battle, with each significant event given a time. From this, I have chosen the time of 3 p.m. to make my depiction of the battle. The two ships have been trading broadsides for a little while, and the Constitution is beginning to get the upper hand. The head of the enemy's bowsprit and the jib boom have been shot away which means the jibs, the head sails of the enemy, have fallen. Soon the foremast would be shot away as well. The Americans were purposely shooting at the British rigging in an attempt to disable the ship. That's why you can see a lot of holes in the sails. So that's my painting of the USS Constitution and what she was up to on the 29th of January, 1812 at 3 p.m.